We're here with Dr. Paul Stewart, professor at École Polytechnique de Montréal and team leader of the Value Chain Optimization Network. Dr. Stewart, thank you for being with us tonight. It's really a pleasure, Greg. Thank you. So you're here with the Value Chain Optimization, among others. Um, so the first question that comes to mind, what exactly is a value chain and what does it bring to the forest sector's transformation? It's a great question because it really is not well understood. Uh, the value chain um, is what it implies going from the very beginning to the very end of the chain. So it starts with the forest and the forest growth model, harvesting biomass, delivering it to a mill, a sawmill, a pulp and paper mill, making products, core products, new products, and then delivering it all the way to the uh, customer's gate. And so we look at that really from cradle to grave uh, so that we can look at the cost of that, we can look at the environmental impact from that with life cycle assessment and other tools. And we can cast forward uh, in time and look at markets and say, is this a good idea or not a good idea? And so um, you can imagine uh, the multidisciplinary approach that's needed for that. We need uh, applied mathematicians, uh, operations researchers, industrial engineers, I'm a chemical engineer, uh, forestry engineers, and we put all these people together and it's a, a very much a, a new community, a uniquely Canadian community. I don't know of anyone else who's quite brought together uh, the value chain practitioners uh, elsewhere than Canada. So I'm sure there's going to be lots of discussions around these topics uh, throughout the week. In terms of value chain, what's the value, in fact, in optimizing it? Well, there's good ideas and bad ideas. Uh, so uh, the fact you're going to you know, modify your business uh, to being a biorefinery in conjunction with your core business, it could be a good or a bad financial and environmental idea. It depends how it's done. And so really we're looking for the Walmarts of the forestry sector. We're looking for guys who are going to do business differently. We're going to put those different pieces together, the warehouses you've got, the mills you've got, the forest access you've got, and make new stuff that nobody can deliver from Indonesia or China uh, more competitively than you. Uh, and so, you know, optimizing that process until you've gone to the point of looking at it one step deeper and identifying those competitive advantages that are there five years or ten years from now even, you don't really know you've got a good idea. So that's what we look at. Very good. Thank you very much, Dr. Stewart, and I hope you have a very productive week this week. Thanks, Greg, and it's a great party. Thank you. <laughs>